Oh yeah, I actually have done an episode on a bed before. <laughs> Look, you don't have to rub it in. <laughs> like, just because we're not your first time. <laughs> this is not my first time doing an episode on my bed. Not my bed. I don't have a bed. You're homeless. Yeah. <laughs> this is why I come hang out here. There's a bed. For the free right. beds. Okay. And welcome to the Mile Beasley Show. Do 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 do. Uh, episode one. I don't know. That's my jingle. That's your jingle. That's my jingle. Okay, got it. Uh, episode number fifty-seven. Holy crap! We were like number. You were like on episode five. What? No, it wasn't really. No, I think it was twelve. Like, are no, you I'm just old? making up a <laughs> random number like this. No, I'm saying she, she's she's been she's been with the program from the start. And who is she? My special co-host this week, Miss Amber Gertner, and my special guest this week is Mia Yim or Jade. Mia Jade. Either or. Are Either or. Or Yimmers. Or Yimmers. Yimmers. That's uh. Well, yeah. only my close friends. Yeah, I was gonna say you're. Oh, I was gonna say. I was gonna say you're gonna get a bunch of like tweets now. Hey Yimmers. I know, right? Dude, I, I will. I, I will kill everybody. <laughs> they call her Yimmers. She will. I. Uh, somebody, please I will do it. Fuck gonna, you up. <laughs> Nobody oh. ever like I know everybody is really em- we're in Emily's room. Careful. <laughs> <laughs> we are in a little girl's room and just said that. Hey, look at all these toys. I'm jealous. I'd never had any so of this. It was like my little well, pony did you and not? stuff. Not that I, know I mean what I that had is. toys, but not like Did you grow up underprivileged? No, I didn't grow up like him. I grew up <laughs> No no I, I, I actually grew up, you know, in the middle class and then Tapered off from there. And this is all well, you have to show. Co- I, I and then I went to college. I even went to college. Dr- and then the drugs, no. alcohol, children, no, who's, who's wrestling? Oh, children, <laughs> children on drugs. Always got to be on the road. <laughs> well, you know. it's doing you well. It serves <laughs> you well. My college education's really paying off right about now. It's okay. I have a college education too. And wrestling, you, yay! <laughs> college like, education. What did you, go to, what did you go to college for? It. IT. Yeah, I'm a computer nerd. I'm Asian. So yeah, yeah. That's the name for me. I'm Asian. It works for me. It's easy it's for me. And so you decided, screw that. I'm gonna get in the wrestling. Yep, pretty much. So how like did you start? Like what? Like what made you say I want to kick people in the face? Because that's pretty much what you do. Yeah, uh, literally. I <laughs> <laughs> I uh, grew up a tomboy, so I always just wanted to play with the boys. You know, do football, basketball, hockey, whatever. And of course, they had no official female football team because I really want to play football and then I saw wrestling I was like oh there's China Alito I can wrestle count me in and so I did Taekwondo when I was younger and then of course when I told my parents they did not approve <laughs> and then the minute I turned 18 I signed myself up for a wrestling school where'd you go like what school like, um uh, I'm not gonna say their name because they sucked and they treated me <laughs> horribly uh because I was a female um, but then I started... Yeah, where'd you get, like, your, like, so, who treated you well? Who said, who welcomed you into the business and decided, you know... Delirious that, that... and Daisy wow. Hayes for Ring of Honor, and then DJ Hyde for CCW. I used I to trained. manage Delirious. Did back you? In the, really? uh, back in the FIP. Oh, man. Yeah. And then he just up and left you. And then up and left me, like they all do. Tyler Black, CM <laughs> Punk, Brian Danielson, mm. Samoa Joe, Austin I bet Aries. you can get Brazak back. Oh, he left me, too. <laughs> Dang, I have a number. Believe me. It might be because I don't bathe. Oh. That that might be. That's a good reason. (laughs) I just (laughs) smelled your armpit. In a little girl's room, no less. So then now this room is going to smell like. Mm, It's going to smell like hope. We can Febreze it. Is it is that gonna work for my from your stench? Yeah. Is it really? I should actually call. I should call my finisher the Febreze. The armpit of the bear smells okay. The bear smells okay. He takes baths. What is he dressed up as? He's dressed as R two D two. So this is something Levi would know about, and I don't know anything about. Don't you feel like that all the time? That's my life, and I feel so sad. Well, then again, I also didn't know what the Ramones was, and you needed to. Poor Yimmers. I, I had to explain to her who the Ramones were. It's so what what type of music do you listen to? I not listen, the Ramones. Not the Ramones. No, definitely not. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> she's very <laughs> not. She's like, uh, I listen to everything, uh, depending on my mood. If I'm, of course, at the gym, which is all the time. Uh, it could be anywhere from Disney tunes, my favorite. And then, you know, anything from... Uh, Immortal Technique is a favorite one. Of I mine. love Immortal Technique. I know. He tweeted me he and t- it made my day. Oh, I know. He drops truth. Yes, he does. That's why I love him. And then Tupac and then um, Kill Switch. Like, it varies. Mm, you shouldn't say Tupac and then Kill Switch. I know. Like, I like it's everything. Kinda, it's kind of rude, right? 
<gasps> and then Brian McKnight. <laughs> oh, so it's 1998 again. <laughs> I love old school stuff. <laughs> that, was, that was my jams. All right, so here on the Milo Beasley Show, we like to do the top five. Okay. Random question. Top five. Top five favorite Disney princesses. Oh Go. God. Elsa? She's, she's, is she a queen or a princess? Does it matter? Okay, she is a queen. Cause, you know. Anna? Mm-hmm. Okay, Anna. Uh, Mul is Mulan a princess? Yes. Mulan? Uh... See, I'd like, to, I'd like you to, like, mix in that, like, uh, the Leva cosplay, and then you cosplay it as Mulan. I would. Or is that too stupid? Is that too stupid? No, that's what we wanted to do that, and then she ruined everything for me, so. Yep. We'll get to that later. Watch the replay, folks, if you didn't watch last night on the side. Yeah, 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 I wasn't, I wasn't there for, like, the first time. In yeah, forever. she's a For the jerk. first time in forever. Oh, my God. I think I just won Mia Young's heart. <laughs> So, okay, <laughs> back to the question. Anna, Mulan, Pocahontas, um, Belle, I like Belle a lot, and then, uh, hmm. Ooh, Ariel. Like Ariel. Ariel? Yeah. She's a little snobby to me. A little bit. A little but... bit, like, you know, like, all she has to do is, like, listen to what her dad says. I know she's, like, a 16-year-old rebellious teen, but yeah. just listen to your dad and bad shit won't happen. You know, that should no. be the, like, that's the moral. She did have Nobody she, really listens to fathers. Yeah, you don't. She yeah. had a lot of stuff. Right. I mean, like, a lot She was a hoarder, stuff. actually. She actually was. She should, she, she she should be, like, Disney Hoarder up. Edition. I would watch that. <laughs> <laughs> that great idea. All right, Ariel? and then one more, so we got, uh, yeah. Oh, no, that's five. Oh, five. That, was five. oh that was five? Okay, I can't count. It's college education. College education. College educated. <laughs> uh, so you have anything for Miss e Mia Yim here before we wrap up? That I love you. I love oh, you. Heart and soul. There's so much love in this room. <laughs> just this side. Uh, uh, oh, I thought you meant just these. Uh, <laughs> well, I, I love like those things. Uh, so before we wrap up, <laughs> <laughs> uh, tell the folks where they can find you on the the Twitter and the Instagram and the Facebook fan pages and uh, you know whatever else. I'm everywhere. Twitter JTNA, Facebook me am Instagram JTNA. I Instagram a lot. Mm -hmm. I just got a new puppy, so it's going to be about Stannis. It's all, I'll say, her Instagram is basically her puppy and her back. Yes. So <laughs> if you like puppies, uh -huh. my puppy, back. my back. <laughs> <laughs> so if you like puppies and backs, uh, that's uh, that's where you, that's a good place to go. So yes, uh, anything else you want to say to the folks watching before we wrap up? Thank you for having me. Hope to be back. Uh, keep watching his stuff. Yeah. He needs to eat. Mm -hmm. Because all the college education is not... Yeah, we're hoping to get sponsors one day, like uh, Jif. Jif? You or, like peanut or, butter. Or, yeah, protein. Nutella. I guess that's that's okay. Allergic to hazelnuts. Jif. <laughs> we'll die. Oh, that's so you prefer oh, yeah. Peter Pan over the Jif? I prefer neither. I like the organic peanut butter. I like the oh. good kind, not the basic Walmart She stuff. is not a basic B. George Washington Carver is rolling over in his grave right now. Yeah, who cares? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for being on the show, and we'll catch you next week. Okay. <laughs>